Hi guys, this is Kids Storytime. Today we are going to be reading Diary of a Wimpy Kid, The Long Haul. This is the first part of it, so let's get started. Um, never read this before, so this is new to me. We will read one. We'll read two days. If there is one thing I've learned from my years of being a kid, it's that you had zero control of, over your own life. Ever since school let out, I haven't done, I haven't had anything I've needed to do or anywhere I've needed to be as long as the air conditioning was working. The TV remote had batteries in it. I was all set for a relaxing summer vacation. Then, out of the blue, this happened. Pack your bags. We're going on a road trip. This isn't this isn't the first time Mom has sprung up on a trip on us without any warning. Last year on the first day of summer, she said we were going to upstate for a few days to visit Aunt Loretta at the nursing home. It wasn't exactly my idea of a fun way to kick off the summer. One time when we visited Aunt Loretta, her roommate grabbed me and wouldn't let go until a staffer gave her a chocolate chip muffin. But Mom was just bluffing about going to the nursing home. At breakfast the next morning, she told us where we were really going. We're going to Disney World! I went there and I'm going there again, so maybe I'll make a video when I'm there. Me and my brother Roderick were happy because we were both dreading spending the first week of summer vacation playing shuffleboard at a nursing home. But when my little brother Manny heard about the change in plans, he totally lost it. Mom had talked up the Aunt Loretta trip so much that Manny was actually excited. Ugh. Already? So they're already here, and they're sad here. We ended up. He ended up postponing our trip to Disney so we could visit Aunt Loretta. You'd think Mom would learn her lesson about surprising trips after that one. I know exactly where this road trip idea came from because the new issue of Family Frolic magazine came out in the mail today. If I had to guess, I'd say 90% of everything we do as a family comes from ideas Mom gets from that magazine. And when I saw the look, late assist you I knew it was going to get mom's wheels turning so there they are Manny's pretty happy and then they're not family frolic adventure rates take the ultimate road trip I flipped through family frolic a few times and I have to admit the pictures always make everything look a lot of fun. Your perfect family barbecue. Summer's here and it's time to break out the grill and fill the cooler with drinks. What a better way to celebrate with the sunshine than with a good old fashioned barbecue. Follow our tips for a day and you'll and you and your family won't soon forget. But there must have been something wrong with our family because we can never measure up to the ones they show in the magazine. That seems like a horror. I'm going to read until, guys, only page, I don't know, I'm going to read it, okay, I already did that one, I guess mom's not giving up though, she said this road trip is going to be aw awesome and that spending a lot of time together in the car will be a bonding experience for the whole family. So guys, I'm going to stop here. I'm going to fold the page. And I'll see you in my next video.
Bye, guys. Excited to see you in the next video? We might read a different book, too, after.